parents and players got into a fight at a youth hockey game, and now an investigation's underway. WBZ's Nick Giovanni spoke with some hockey families who say this sets a horrible example. Misbehaving parents, not unusual for hockey. Four parents suspended indefinitely from mass hockey for a fight that's now the subject of a police investigation in Tewksbury. To the credit of a lot of players, you know, they didn't participate in it, but there were a handful of players on each team that did, and, uh, and then, it, again, parents got involved, and, and that's really where the problem started. Video circulating on social media shows the fight initially breaking out on the ice last weekend toward the end of a game between 18 and under hockey teams from Tewksbury and Raynham, facing off in a tournament at the Breakaway Ice Center. But then, parents start getting involved, some stepping out onto the ice. Seconds later, fists start flying on the other side of the glass. At least one player was injured, suffering a cut on the face. It can get pretty heated. Um, you know, parents yelling at their players, parents yelling at your players, or goading, you know, the goalies. You know, it goes all the way down to U8 where parents goat, you know, the kids. It's just horrible sportsmanship for, for kids to see. Parents pulling up to the ice rink Thursday morning to sit in the stands for an early game, focused on the example this sets for their younger kids. I don't know. I don't know how you prevent that. You know, coming off of COVID, I'm just so happy to watch my kids play on the ice and be able to go into the rink and not sit on my phone in the car watching Live Barn. The youth players that were probably in the stands yeah. or getting ready for their game, you know, this is an example you're setting for those kids. And, you know, we want the sport to continue in a positive light. The head of Massachusetts Youth Hockey says there's a zero tolerance policy for incidents involving parents. They, you know, certainly can't do what they did. And uh, as a result, we've summarily suspended uh, four individuals, uh, two from each of the programs uh, that were involved in it. And uh, they have the right to a hearing with Massachusetts Hockey, and, and they may uh, you know, choose to do that. But at this point, they have been issued suspensions uh, indefinitely. Both teams had a couple games left on the schedule this upcoming weekend, but we're told those have been canceled. Their seasons effectively cut short. The police investigation continues. Reporting in Tewksbury, Nick Giovanni, WBZ News.